Tutongo gara barracks. As your defense and security services, we are heartened by your display of composure, order and discipline during various matches which occurred at the weekend without any public violence. Meetings with His Excellency the President and Commander-in-Chief of the Zimbabwe Defence Forces, Comrade Robert Gabriel Mgabe, have gone on in an atmosphere of mutual respect and several guarantees have been made. Following the address to the nation by His Excellency the President of the Republic of Zimbabwe and Commander-in-Chief of the Zimbabwe Defence Forces last night, we have made further consultation with the President to agree on a roadmap on the prevailing situation in the country. I encouraged by new developments which include conduct between the President and the former Vice President, Comrade Emerson Dambuzom Nangagwa, who is expected in the country shortly. Thereafter, the nation will be advised on the outcome of talks between the two. As the Zimbabwe Defense and Security Services urge Zimbabweans to remain calm and patient, fully observing and respecting the laws of the country for the sustenance of the precious peace we should never lose. The Zimbabwe Defense and Security Services further urge other political players, including members of the ruling ZAN PF, the veterans of the liberation struggle, opposition groups, students, and generality of our people to refrain from any actions or activities that would threaten the peace, life, students at the country's various institutions are encouraged to be calm and, and to proceed with their educational programs.